I am really excited today to be launching the first in our series of Thread Talks, where we talk to inspirational women about their brow journeys. And today I am super excited to have Estée Lalonde, who was one of the first beauty bloggers back in 2011. And since then she has collaborated with a well-known jewellery brand and launched her own body care brand called Mirror Water. And that's very much about looking introspectively as well as externally. Estée's always been open and honest about mental health issues and we know beauty is skin deep. And today we're gonna to talk a little bit more about that. So I'm delighted to be chatting today. Hi! Thanks so much for joining us on the brown sofa. Thank you for having me. I'm so excited to be here. Well I'm as well because you have been coming to Blink for a long time. We're privileged to have you as you are the beauty guru. I just want to delve straight into what is your kind of go-to morning routine. Well first things first, cup of tea immediately. Like right off the bat, tons of oat milk in there, get that straight into my veins. And then after I walk my dog, you know, have my shower, I'm very into skincare. I take a lot of time in my skincare in the morning. Oh, do you? And do you, is that every day? Do you follow the yes. same ritual? Yes, yes. Every single day I'm massaging, I'm doing the ice things on my face, and I'm just trying to pep up a little bit. Do you think the beauty landscape's changed since you started writing about it about, I know, 10 years ago? Yeah, completely. It's such a different space now. I think the consumer is so much more intelligent than they were, like, say, 10 years mm. ago. and. I think a lot of people are, you know, discovering products in different ways. You know, back when I first started, it was very much like what was advertised to us on TV and that was like the product we wanted to try. Yes. And now it's it's a lot different. Yeah, and you have a, a new body care brand. I so, do. Which is really exciting and I and I just want to find out more about it because, you know, I think brows, we haven't, we haven't got onto brows yet, but I think brows... Um, express a lot about people and how they're feeling and uh, you know hopefully we give them confidence when they come and get their brows done uh, you know I've been led to believe that the body care brand is very much about making you feel good inside as well yeah. as outside yeah it's all about sort of nourishing your inner world in hopes that it's going to help you interact with the outer world a little bit better so it's all about that inner balance and but in a realistic way you know I, I'm not gonna say that having a bath is gonna change your life but it might just like help ground you a little bit. Yeah, it kind of does change your life. I think it's it kind of those moments, isn't it? <laughs> Just taking time out yeah. and reflecting. Yeah, which is really exactly. Nice. You've got it right there. Yeah. Reflecting, that's our key word. And tell me about a brow defining moment for you because I know brows are important. In your uh, life. Well, you know what? They say that your eyes are the windows to the soul and your eyebrows are the curtains. And I really feel like that. Your curtains, I really, agree. I'm nodding. In the <laughs> yeah. They showcase your face, and yeah. I think we've all had those brow moments where you think, "What has happened?" I remember one of my best friends plucking out every single one of my eyebrows. I swear, I was left with like the skinniest little line. Um, but honestly, I'm not just saying this. But when I first started getting my brows threaded here at Blink, it, that changed my life. That was a brow defining moment. I didn't think I could have, like you know, eyebrow hair at the tails there. I never thought I could have that. And they completely transformed my brows. Oh, that is just so nice to hear because I think people don't really believe how transformational it can be mm. until they come and do it. Yeah, so, yeah. Um, and I, you know, I think when, when, we, when I started the business, it was always an afterthought in, beauty's, uh, in people's beauty regime. And now I think people have sat up and taken notice, yeah. so, uh, which is amazing. Absolutely, and when my brows are done, I honestly feel like everything else is just gonna be okay. I love the ritual of beauty, and I think you do that so well here at Blank as well. You know, taking that time to run yourself a bath, to have your brows done, to like wash and dry your hair, you know, these are all rituals, and it's almost a type of meditation. I know when I'm doing my skincare routine, I'm just like processing the day and processing various feelings, and. It's not just about what's on the surface, and I think because it's like a topical thing and it's what you're showing on the outside, it's people can kind of think it's just this sort of flippant thing, but actually it's all about what's on the inside. Yeah. I love beauty. And can you share with me, what's your go-to thing to do uh, to make you feel really confident? And I can tell you anything. Anything. Nice set of lingerie. I love it. Wow, so you felt, again, good on the inside. Yeah, good on the inside. So, yeah. And it just completely changes how I feel. It doesn't even have to be like anything crazy. It's just a nice matching set. I'm like, ooh. And, they're okay. gonna be, and it's gonna be matching. It's gotta be matching. Yeah. yeah. No, I get it. It's great. <laughs> Thank you, Estee. That was wonderful. Thank Thanks you so much. Thanks for coming and joining me on the Brown Thank Sacred you. Today. Gosh, I wanna have a bath now. We love beauty. <laughs>